So I've gathered all the material, well, probably not all, probably have to end up going back for this thing. So here's my little design sketch, and this was a rant I had about YouTube, but whatever. We're gonna see if I post this, <laughs> but it's true though. Lately on YouTube, um, there's a lot of just copying going on, no one's really being original, it's all about being relevant rather than talented and the broken few counts every few months so go from like a good amount of view counts to like almost nothing by the way don't pay attention to that <laughs> it's getting pretty cute but it's taken forever welcome to my crafty mess <laughs> yep this is yup the update actually this would make a pretty good instagram picture you know what i'm gonna post that Oh my gosh, guys, the... what's it called? Let me just... Oh my gosh, guys, that Beauty and the Beast thing. I was like, no, nah, make something easy and quick, and how wrong am I? I am so wrong. Don't mind my hair. I have to go shower, because I was invited to give a panel talk on branding for, for YouTube. I don't think I'm the expert at all, <laughs> nowhere near. But I guess because my channel is like geeky crafts, so it's a very specific kind of brand, as they would call it. Um, I said sure, yeah, why not? I'll give it a go. It's downtown, and afterwards I'm going to meet Pat for supper. We have that one favorite place that we love going to, which is kind of like Arabic food. It's really spicy, really good. And Angel is <laughs> he's stalking me. But yeah, wow, that thing takes forever. It's like... Make a little piece, bake, make a little piece, bake, 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 stick, 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 cross-eyed. <laughs> I'm having just, okay, this is like, I think, other than the Pokemon Go, which has taken me time because of the layers of resin, this one actually is taking me time because of the amount of baking I have to do. I'm sure if you're more dexterous, but look at my big fingers, if you're more dexterous than me, you probably don't have to bake as much, but... Because I don't have that much confidence that I won't smush things with my fingers, with my sausage fingers. I bake. So I'll leave that at your discretion. But yeah, it does take time. It, it is it is time consuming, guys. Even if I'm painting a lot of the details, it's still pretty time consuming. Where's my hair? Always like that. This is how my hair gets at the end of a day. Oh, I almost got a heart attack. I'm like, is that a speck? No, but there was a speck on my phone. I was like gonna get a heart attack for you guys. But yeah, this is what my hair looks like at the end of a day. I usually keep it this way. But yeah, I'm gonna go shower. Um, hopefully I can be done with the project before I go out. And then I'm gonna do the car, well, warm up the car, <laughs> and then head out. I don't know if I'll be able to take videos over there, but I can show you guys. I think it's a small, it's a pretty small event, so that's why I'm like, no, nah, I'm okay with it. I'm just not very good in public settings. Oh, big bird. Oh, big bird. Where'd you go? Come back. Is he gonna do peekaboo? Peekaboo! Oh, upside down bird. Of course, I can't compliment the bird without Splinter getting jealous. Hey, baby. Who's the jealous sandwich cat? <laughs> all clean and on my way to the panel of course being Montreal we're almost the capital of traffic I think Toronto beats us on that but yeah I'm stuck in traffic it says it's gonna take me about 20 minutes more to get to where I need to go truck <laughs> and tunnel I'm going in, in a tunnel so yeah so I'm stuck here and Figured might as well chit chat with you guys a little bit, get you but a little bit updated. I'm hoping that thing doesn't fall. It seems to like doing that, so if it does, I'll catch it. And anyways, we're in traffic, so whenever we stop, <laughs> I'll put it back on. Um, so what I wanted to talk about just quickly, I know I've, I've said this before and I was frustrated with my health and all that stuff, but recently it's been, it's actually been pretty bad. Um, I don't know why, because I've been eating like non-inflammatory type foods. But my inflammation's been so bad these last two weeks, and I'm in just so much pain. I know I'm, I'm, I'm smiling and, 
and laughing. But the, there are moments where I think the best way for me to cope, at least that's that's my self-defense mechanism, is to uh, laugh and stay busy. But I think the last two weeks have been the worst pain I've been in uh, in the last maybe five years. So I don't know what's going on. And I could go see a doctor. But the thing is, they never do anything. They seriously, they do jack. You go there, they're like, all right, blood test. You look at the blood test, and your blood test seems fine, so you must be fine. It's like, dude, I'm not lying to you. Like, look at the blood. <laughs> and by the way, I hope this is not too graphic, but yeah, the inflammation sometimes gets so bad that my skin um, tears and I do bleed. So, I mean, I show them this, and they're like, well, we don't know. There's nothing we could do. Um, but yeah, that's, that's why I don't like doctors, because you go there for hope, at least for me. I'm sure, I'm sure they've helped a lot of people. But for me, every time I've gone to a doctor, the only thing I've, I've gone through was despair. So I don't want to go. I figure uh, the body is made to heal itself on some things. So I'm hoping this is the one, one of those things. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. I'm hoping it'll ride it out. I've been like taking my, my supplements a little more now and, and seeing if that helps a little bit. Because the doctors really won't do anything for me. And I could go one more time and try look my file is big and they're just like well we don't know you're just that's how you're born <laughs> it's like thanks dude <laughs> you were so useful I've been to many doctors I've even been private doctors and the lady's like well according to your blood test you look pretty good I'm like damn it <laughs> stop saying that <laughs> so she's like I have a solution for you I'm like oh okay that's 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 new here's some antidepressants I'm like oh, are you kidding me I don't think that's a solution what are you gonna do? So yeah, I figured I'd update you guys. We're still very trafficy. It's still moving though. I'm actually surprised. So let's get going. Been at a complete standstill for the last 10 minutes, trying to turn, but nobody's turning because everybody's blocking our way over there. Come on, guys. I'm like gonna be so late. I don't know. <laughs> I really don't know what to feel right now. I am waiting. I'm just sitting here and it's supposed to take me 40-ish minutes to get here. I'm still not there and it's been an hour and a half practically. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Why is it like that? Yeah, this, this is my fed up voice. I go, I go like all crackly. Why? <laughs> I'm really fed up. I don't even know what's going on. Why is everything a standstill? I mean, the roads are clear. Yeah, people are angry. <laughs> people are so frustrated. Because there's this idiot blocking the road. Yeah, this is me road raging. Idiots. Out there. Everywhere. Blocking the road, even though it's not their turn. It's clearly red. But they're like, you know what? I waited enough. Yeah, but everyone's waited enough now. I don't even think I'm going to make it at this light. I just have to wait. Guys, don't step on the pedestrians. <laughs> I'm hoping that green pea over there is the parking area. So it's got to be the parking area. I need to get there. Because it seems that the reason there's all this traffic is because of the snowstorm. Let me show you guys over there. So this is a two lane. But because of the snow, as you can see, like over here, the snow has completely covered a whole lane. So... This is just one of them. I don't know about all the other streets, but I guess we're going to see what happens. Random Jackie fact. You guys see the EA building over there? I used to work at EA, actually, when uh, a good few years ago. <laughs> I used to work as a game tester there. And it's not all it's awesome sounding to be. Um, it was kind of cool, but it was boring at the same time. The people were really nice. Other employees... I was with it's kind of neat but they would hire almost anyone because they fired a lot of people often or people left randomly a lot I think I stayed there for about maybe eight months until I got really bored because I was playing uh, what's that game anyway I was playing a car game which I I'm not a fan of I am, okay I think I'm in B parking where am I going I am late they called me they're like where are you I'm like I'm stuck <laughs> 
Where am I going? I am gonna be so lost, guys. I won't be able to find my car. Dang it. Um. Whoa. <laughs> um. Elevators? Okay. Um. I have no idea where I am. J'ajouterais que si vous avez envie de vous partir une chaîne YouTube, il ne faut pas se mettre des barrières en pensant à un branding tout compliqué. That's how bad the streets are. Look at these hills. Cars are not even parked on the side of the streets. Like hill, car, hill, hill. <laughs> Finally home. I'm so tired. It's been a pretty long couple of days. And yeah, hopefully tomorrow is a half long day because I have to still edit, publish the Beauty and the Beast dollhouse. And then I'm good. I started out hating this project, but now I was like, hmm, looking after at it after a few hours, I'm like, it's okay. It's not, it's not tragically bad. <laughs> so I think it's okay. So I'm going to head to bed. I'm like, so tired. <laughs> I'm gonna head to bed and hope I'm gonna see what I may have changed that maybe is making me in more pain so I'm gonna check that out my guess is maybe because I'm eating more green vegetables and someone with Hashimoto's should not be eating too many green vegetables but I was like in a green vegetable mood this week I was like maybe it won't do anything but maybe, maybe that could be causing the extra discomfort. So we'll see that. But yeah, thanks for, <laughs> thanks for tolerating all my randomness, guys. I'm just going to go sleep and just bundle up and dream of fun adventures in a fantasy world. Well, get your mind out of the gutter, not that kind. Like, I mean drag. Still get your mind out of the gutter. <laughs> Good night, guys.